First stage is getting the flour coating ready for the lemon sole. So I've measured out 50 grams of flour just to start with for the two fillets. Adding some fresh cracked black pepper in there and then some salt as well. And that just seasons the flour. Mix it all through. Next step in prep, just your lemon. Just get the lemon juice in here, ready to be added later. And then finally chop up a handful of fresh parsley. So we're going to get on to cooking the lemon so I've got a frying pan. I'm going to heat this up in the hob first and when it's hot I'm going to add the oil. I've also got another plate here because once we've breaded it, cooked it, we're going to put the two fillets onto here and then build up the rest of the sauce, melt the butter, etc., in the pan to then drizzle over the cooked lemon sole fillets. So just have another plate prepped. And once your pan has heated up, we're going to add the oil. Just don't want the oil burning. And then add your breaded fish. Now your lemon soles are really delicate fish, so we only need a couple of minutes on each side. There we go. And I've got myself a fish slice to keep it all intact in one piece. So I'll give it two minutes on that side, two minutes on the other side, out and onto the plate you've got sitting at the side. So after two minutes on each side, that's that fillet done, nice and golden. And as I said, we're just going to transfer that on to your plate and cook the other one. Now we see here I'm using the fish slice actually just to almost weight it down. And that's so that the fish doesn't curl up at the edges too much. You can also put some heavier on top if you want as well. There's my timer going, so that's this one also done. And we're going to add that into the plate with the other one. There we go. And we're going to get on to the sauce now. So I'll add a little bit of flavour. I'm going to get a silicone spatula to use. That means I'm probably getting your teeth at that. 75 grams of butter. Turn the heat down. Tablespoon of capers. One or two tablespoons of lemon juice, up to you. Melt that all together. Butter's all melted. I'm deciding I'm actually going to add another wee tablespoon of capers. So I'll put one to two tablespoons of capers and lemon juice down to choice. And we're just going to drizzle that over your lemon sole fillets. I'm going to add a little bit of the parsley in the sauce and then the rest will be for a garnish on top. Stir through, add on top of your lemon sole fillets. 